Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel, Dumpster Cam. I'm coming at you from another thrift store. I had an early morning doctor's appointment today, so I figured on the way home I might as well stop and see what I can find. It is currently about 9.20 in the morning. They just opened at 9. Um, I have never been here at this time. I usually come later in the evening, but it's actually a lot busier than I expected for it to be so early on this very foggy day. <laughs> Um, so we are going to head in. I do know this store doesn't typically have tons of stuff, aside from clothes. Most thrift stores do, but, um, I have definitely found some good things here. So let's see what we can find. Coming back in with the voiceover. Here's just an overview of the store. Lots and lots of clothes. And then over here are the house goods. Discounts of the week, orange and green. Right at the beginning of the store, they always have the seasonal stuff. Just a few little things. This I thought was adorable. I might try to take off the Easter parade, but 60 cents couldn't pass it by. Came home with me. This I also love the fabric. I just didn't take it home. All right, going to the tchotchke aisle now. It was pretty well stocked today. Nothing extremely fabulous, but this little goose caught my eye. Super cute. Again, 60 cents. Put it in my cart. Some more stuff, take a little peek. Fish. Here's another goose. It's a little shiny girl goose. She took a ride with me for a while, but I ended up putting her back. That little tulip thing up there to the right, I thought I bought that and I, I, I forgot and I did wanna buy that. <laughs> Maybe I'll go back. But these I thought were cute, just little light switch covers apples and this little swan I didn't love her but 150 not too bad now this I was not expecting to find that there but it the pastels and it was half off so about 150 super cute these I also loved there was no price but I definitely would have brought these home if I had any light switch covers like light switches of doubles or triples but I don't all right, here's the basket aisle. I always love the basket aisle. This store has some of, some of the best baskets around me, at least. Look how cute this one is with the little hearts. Again, orange, half off. So about 125 for that. That did end up making it into my cart. This, I just like the pastels on. And another little random aisle here. wood boxes oh another sideways clip it said a spoiled rotten cat lives here <laughs> which is funny and then this I'll show you a little bit better later but look how cute the little guy is in that basket that came home with me <laughs> I thought these were kind of cool definitely vintage prints on this wood thing and then this clock I've seen for months now at the thrift store and I, I do love it and I just don't know where I'd put it but now maybe I'm thinking I should go back and get it and find a spot for it because it's just so cute with the sunflowers here is the other holiday aisles they always have Christmas and a lot of Easter I feel and then on the back of that is holiday as well this was adorable a little quilted backpack that said happy Easter on it three bucks and then on the inside was the cute little rabbit and then the teeny tiny rabbit baby. So cute. Scary. But this was fun. I'm glad I went down the Easter aisle because I loved that. Only 60 cents, this little pastel tin that came home with me. Not too many lamps today, but this one was pretty kind of iridescent with the flowers. And this I've seen at the store for a while as well. I just think it's adorable little tea set. I love the pattern. I don't have any need for a tea set. Always love the glassware and the plates and everything. Cute little crock with the vegetables on it, but it had a chip. Pretty big chip. This plate was cute too. Same with these with the little yellow. Little set there. I liked the colors on this. 
usually the chicken rooster stuff aren't colored like that. This as well, this plate reminded me of the 90s coloring that was on the cups and stuff back then. Big mug section. I'm not a mug user. I don't drink coffee or anything. Um, but yeah, love that picture. And I love these kind of art pieces with the texture, but that one doesn't fit my decor, so stayed behind. Here's some of the art. This was cute. I wasn't going to, but I did end up taking it home. Here is just some of the furniture, not much. And then I loved this. My eye was drawn to it. I, I mean, it's, I wouldn't put it in my space, but I liked it. Pillows and linens, nothing especially good there today. But this crock pot was just adorable. Look at how sweet those colors are. So cute. And this was absolutely adorable. They actually put this out while I was at the store, so I went back to film it. It's like a little kid's writing desk. Very nice on the inside there. And look, it even has drawers on the side. I thought that was awesome. And $15.99, great deal. I hope somebody snatched it up. This store usually has a really good selection of puzzles and everything. I've gotten some really fun ones there. Uh, look at this one. It's a cat puzzle. All the cats on it, but look at when I open it up. <laughs> None of them came home with me, though. <laughs> Coming in at the end with the haul here. I made it out with a fairly small haul this time. I am also packing up quite a bit to take to donate tomorrow, and I think I'm going to take it to the this thrift store. I know there's quite a few in my area, but I think this is the one I'm going to take it to to donate. Um you know, bring things in, take things out. <laughs> I got everything I showed you, I believe. Cute little basket. The faux stained glass duck. I was able to scrape off where it said Easter Parade. This is obviously not like real vintage or anything. Um, it's just painted on the back. I scraped it off and now I need to scrape the sticker off because they always put them in the worst places. But I thought that was kind of cute. I did end up buying this. Um, I don't really know what it is. The lady at checkout was like, oh, that looks like a lid of a jar. And I thought, hmm, it kind of does. But I don't know. There was no price on this or this shelf. She gave them both to me for a dollar. This is just like a little stand with a little cat in the basket all tucked in. How sweet is that? Little picnic blanket. I got the little yellow. I don't know if I showed this to you. I got this little yellow basket. I don't know what I'm gonna do with that yet. I did get this little Mr. Duck. I thought he was cute. I got this pastel canister. I have never in my life found more canisters than I have in the past few weeks. Like they are all just adorable. I can't pass them by. And I am going to utilize them. Some in the kitchen, some obviously not in the kitchen. I have a lot in the bathroom and some in the living room with some incidentals, I don't know. And then this tin, which I don't know what it was originally. Um, it was only 60 cents though. Something made in England. But I just thought that was adorable. Especially with this chicken. I think I have, no, I don't. I thought I had something that matched it. Maybe I saw something similar. I don't know, but just adorable. So that's the, the haul. And I think that's it. As always, thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to my channel, Dumpster Cam. And I will be back very soon with some more dumpster, food, thrifting, fun, cat, all sorts of videos. So I appreciate you guys as always. I read all of your comments. Thank you.
All right, my dad's trunk is all loaded up. I'm going to take this to the thrift store. We got clothes, shoes, pillows, plant stuff, all sorts of things. Feels good to get rid of stuff sometimes, not bring it in.